Today, we're gonna to talk about why the visualization of the thing is not the thing. When you hear something like this, you might think, huh, of course the map is not the territory. I know. When I look at a map, I'm not looking at the thing. When we do our work, we often act as if the map is the thing. When you look at a map of mountains, it's not a mountain. You can't feel the map paper and feel the snow caps of the mountains you're passing over. In fact, it's simply a representation of the mountain. The details aren't there. Another example that I've heard from this author I know named Robert Anton Wilson is even if you're thirsty, saying water isn't going to make you unthirsty. You're not going to relieve yourself of your thirst by saying water. What does this mean for our work? Well, it means that we have to remember that although we plan and we sketch and we figure out the high level of the things of what we're doing, we can't find and see the complications of what the project is until we're on the ground and working. At a certain point, we can't reference the map as the thing. As I said before, what are you gonna believe? Feeling the snow of the mountains or the, the paper that has the mountain top on it. Too often as leaders, we sometimes refer back to the map when the actual thing is right in front of us. The big takeaway here is do not confuse the map as the territory. The visualization of the thing is not the thing.